Let's see. I got three in here. How did I miss this? I'm amazed by amounts I've missed throughout this whole game. I could have gone when I got there. Uh, that's going to take a little bit. Okay, I think I see where I need to go. Now, I just need to figure out how to get there. I watched in silence as he brought in the woman. Her skin, now a venomous green. Poison Ivy. The wanton creature no longer looked like a human being, much less a woman. The Bible says, suffer not a witch to live. Yet he has once again delivered this female atrocity to our care. Once I have dealt with the monster, I think it will be time to see if green wood does, in fact, burn. Jeez, I'm surprised he hasn't said anything about Batman existing, if he's talking about the rogues. I mean, we had Killer Croc show up in the one these, now we have Poison Ivy. I wonder what his thoughts on Batman was. <laughs> Sitting in the darkness outside of his cell. I watched the crazed twitching, listened to the disgusting words that came from his mouth. How can I let a dirty animal like this live? He is the cancer I have sworn to protect the city from. Hey, right, about third way through this one.
it really that easy? Oh, wait, no, it's right there. Curse me for a fool. How could I not see it until now? The monster had a confederate. I hid in the darkness near his cell and saw with my own eyes one of the doctors whispering to him. She looked at him through the transparent barrier with tenderness, with, dare I say, desire. Harley Quinn. My skin crawled with revulsion as she kissed the glass, fighting the urge to dash the woman's head through the glass. I let her continue. The damnable clown might have shared secrets with her that would be useful once the mad dog has been executed. I'm sure the woman will reveal what she knows to me. If not willingly, then certainly under electronic persuasion. After that, a lobotomy, I think. Unfortunate for one so young. But her lust has put the reputation of Arkham at stake. Yes, a lobotomy. The very thing. There is no other way to ensure her silence in this regrettable matter. Jeez, this guy just creeps me out the more I find out about him. Is there anything underneath this? Yep. We're going back into. Okay. Well, damn, that escalated very quickly. Gonna be quite a few looking to here. Get 
again, I found myself watching him. No one can provide a cure. He laughs in the face of those who try. Amadeus would not have let him live, and neither should I. One last sip of cognac, and I was ready. Amadeus. Wait, who is this if it's not Amadeus Arkham? I don't think I ever got the whole story of this one. Ah, there we go. We know they're safe. Did you know that the children's area of sight can provide you with a detailed but discreet psychiatric profile of your problem? Why is there a children's area of Arkham Asylum? You think people want kids away from this area? Are they child patients or something? That's terrifying to think about. I entered the cell. He smiled as I showed him the knife. I told him how I will use it, how I will cleanse this city. And then, terror. I was paralyzed. I struggled. I screamed, but I was silent. The monster looked at me, expressionless. He ran my blade slowly across my forehead. A smile cracked across his horrible porcelain face, and I heard the filth fall from his mouth. He laughed and called me that horrible name. What horrible name are they talking about? I'm very invested in this, no matter how much it's creeping me out. I just need to find three more. What? Okay, I actually had it this time for once. I've actually been just buying them. I mentioned wanting to at some point when I couldn't find some of them, but I just kept looking at some point. Seeing it, I can already guess on where I need to look next. Here then. <clears throat> oh, that's cool. I didn't even realize I could do this. <clears throat> of 
first I'm going here. There's no shame in cheating. If you admit you cannot solve my challenges. Let's discuss your obsession with Batman. Hardly an obsession, Miss Young. I simply feel an obligation to expose him. You know who he is? More important, I know what he is. What do you mean? It's obvious. The mask, the weapons, the scare tactics. He's a criminal. No different than Joker, Two-Face, or myself. Most people consider him a hero. Most people are idiots. They can't see Batman for the villain he is. Read only this. How did he get his car and his gadgets? Um, With money stolen from the criminals he defeats. Why does Gordon turn a blind eye to his antics? Batman bribes him. The answers are right in front of your stupid talking face. Okay, where is this one? Oh! Okay, I just got one more in this area to get. I'm pretty sure it's in Bane's area. This is my final interview with Edward. I have gone as far as I can. I can no longer tolerate his mood swings and tantrums. I have more important work to be getting on with. He will be transferred to Dr. Whistler's care as of next week. Good morning, Doctor. How are you today? Fine, thank you, Edward. What a good mood. I'm always in rare spirits when I'm about to be released. Edward, you know you don't come up for parole for another three years. First thing I'll do is have dinner at that Italian place on 19th Street. Seriously, Edward. I only hope Joker hasn't completely trashed the city. Oh well, I'm sure I'll find out soon enough. Wait, have you been in contact with the Joker? He escaped off my weeks ago. And yet, one hears things. What things? What do you hope? Oh, something about a surprise party for Batman. I forget the rest. You know Joker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Edward, if you know anything you've got to tell me, lives could be at stake. What did Joker say? You forget, Doctor. I'm the one who asks the riddles. I think that's the last of them. Of the interview tapes, I mean. It's too bad there's no fast travel in this to get to another one of the areas. That would have been really helpful. Which is, how did I not find it earlier? Yeah, how the hell did I miss this one? I remember finding... I remember seeing it when I was editing earlier.
It must have been Crane. Another one who doesn't deserve to live. Why do these people thrive on chaos? Joker, in particular, desired anarchy. And since his escape will no doubt wreak it upon my city, I feel this is the end for my diary. Joker will be recaptured. My story will be told. I am not afraid. If Arkham becomes my cell, then I will know I did my best. I will be remembered. Just done that to begin with. Uh, there he is. spirit of Amadeus Arkham. Even though Amadeus had long since passed, his spirit lived on, surviving, moving through the walls of his asylum. When it chose me, I felt proud. I was honored to continue his work, to cleanse this city. If you are strong-willed enough to follow my tales, you are strong-minded enough to it was Hugo, isn't my it? Identity. Come and find me, friend. Together, we will save Gotham. It has to be Hugo Strange. I'm embarrassed to be this long to put it together. Also, because he's pretty much a doctor Ar at Arkham, most known for figuring out Batman's identity in comics. A well-known Batman villain from the very beginning of the comics. I'm talking, talking back when Batman actually killed his enemies. Or wasn't afraid to use lethal force back then. That one was impossible to solve. How did you do it? Impossible to solve is a glowing green question mark. It's possible to miss. Yeah, I see that wall. I actually didn't see this one.
Oh, thank God, that was all the Joker teeth. I'm actually surprised Joker hasn't said anything about me not showing up as of yet. Okay, I only got five more riddles. The caves. That's the last area I need to go to before I go to those last four. I just need to remember how I got out of here the first time. I'm losing patience. Ah, oh, there you we go. Cheating. You must be. That was all I need to arrest him. And I just need to wait for it to happen. Or rather, not wait, but I need to think. Get the rest so I can actually hear him get arrested. Just one more. Now, where is it? There it is. What? You did it? You must have cheated. There is no way you could have beaten me. Well, you asked for it, Batman. My final challenge for the whole of Gotham is just seconds away. What? Silence. The police. You cheated. You couldn't have outsmarted me. Satisfying to hear. I have no idea where this last one is. I'm guessing it's Hugo Strange, maybe? I'm just going to look it up. It's the only thing I'm actually looking up here. A few moments later. Oh my god, how the... <laughs> I'm an idiot.
There's no other way around it. I'm a freaking idiot. The voice should get in the way. I'm just calling myself for having to look this one up. I am proud that I actually got found all the realer stuff by myself for once. Either David, there's Mr. Freeze. I'm sure it's this one. Yeah, this is the right way. Of course, it wasn't Hugo Strange. Quincy Sharp, the spirit of Amadeus Arkham. You have done well to decipher my story, and I pray it has helped you on your path. I trust that through my writings you will do what is right. Please, I implore you, continue my work. This city deserves a savior. Continue my work. Seriously, how the hell did I not put it together from the voice itself? Why did the warden take off so quick? I thought you told him to stay put. 